Good afternoon. I'm Samuel Guayamabe, and I'm going to talk about how Amazon, Apple, Facebook, and Google manipulate our emotions. Um, our species has a need of for a super being. Our compar comparative advantage as a species is our brain. Our brain is robust enough to ask a lot of really difficult questions like uh, why we are here or uh, um, who I am but unfortunately it doesn't have it doesn't have the processing power to answer them which creates a need for a super being that we can pray to and look for answers where is a prayer in first point sending a query into the universe and hopefully there is some absurd divine intervention we don't need to understand to understand what's going on from all from an all-knowing all-seeing super being that give gives us authority that this is the right answer will be we are we are all right or we are something different where where are we from where we are we from you have you have your planet of stuff you have your planet work you have your planet friends and in your universe the sun is uh, the thing that you think that is the most important to you and um, in a sense of technology our super being is Google. Is Google is our mother man's god. Imagine your face and your name above everything you put into the into that box, and you are going to realize you trust Google more than any enti entity in your history. One of the other wonderful things about our species is we not only need to be loved, but we need to love others. That this is a this is a mistake for humans uh, the the that we can we say our love but uh, um, the best sign that, that you might be to tear to part to be part of the number one fast growing demographic in the world that is the centenarians um, Okay, let's talk about Amazon now. In the in the sense of technology, Amazon is our consumptive good. The instinct the instinct of more is hardwired into us. The penalty for two years is starvation and malnutrition. Open your cupboards, open your closet. You have ten to one hundred x times that you need. Why? Because the penalty for too little is much greater greater than the penalty for too much. So more for less is a business strategy that never goes out of style. Is the strategy of China it's a strategy of Walmart own or it's a strategy for the of the world by Amazon? You get more for less into your gut, digest, send into your muscular and skeletal system of consumption. Uh, once we know, once we know, we we will survive. The basic instinct. We move to the second most powerful instinct, and that is to spread and select the strongest, smartest, and fastest seed. To the far to the four corners of the earth or pick the best seat this is not a time piece i haven't wounded in five years uh, it's my vain vain to uh, to attempt <coughs> um as a result these companies apple amazon facebook and google have disarticulated who we are God, love, consumption, and sex. This is four things that we are forgetting about. 
the proportion in your approach to those th those things is who you are and they have reassembled who we are in the form of for-profit companies at the end of the great recession the market capitalization capitalization of these companies was equivalent to gdp of niger ha now it is equivalent to gdp of india having blown the past russia and canada in 2000, 2013 and, th and 2014 there are only five nations five nations that have a gdp rating that the combined mar market capitalizations of the four of these four companies <clears throat> something ha something is happening the, the conversation just a year ago was which ceo was more jesus like who was running for president? Now the worm has turned. Er, has turned. Everything they are doing is bothering us. We are worried that they. We are worried they are tax avoiders. Walmart, since the Great Recession, has paid 64 billion dollars in corporate income tax. Amazon has paid 1.4 billion dollars. How do we pay our firefighters, our soldiers, and our social workers? It's the most, it's the most successful companies in the world. That means that the less successful companies have to pay more than the first share. <coughs> this is despite the fact that Amazon has had the entire market capitalization of Walmart to its market cap in the last 19 months. Whose fault is it? It's our fault. We are electing regulators who don't have the backbone to actually go after these companies. Facebook lies to United States regulators and says it would be impossible for us to share the data between our core platform and our proposed acquisition of WhatsApp approve the merge the merge they they approve the merge and then spoiler alert they figure it out and the USA is I feel lied to we are fining you 120 million dollars about six percent of the acquisition price of 19 billion dollars if Mark Zuckerberg couldn't could take out an insure an insurance policy that the acquisition would go through for six percent. Why wouldn't he do it? <clears throat> Another aspect of the human being is an anti-competitive behavior. A two and a half half billion dollar fine, three billion of the cash flow, three percent of the cash on Google balance sheet. We are telling these companies the smart thing to do, the shareholder driving thing to do, is to lie and to cheat. We are issuing 50 cent parking tickets on a mirror that costs $100 an hour. The smart thing to do is lie. Job destruction. Amazon only needs one person for two at Macy's. If they grow their business, $20 billion this year this year, which which they will, we will lose 53,000 53, cashiers and koshers and clerks. This is nothing unusual. This has happened all through our economy. We just never seen companies this where I did. That's one Yankee stadium of workers. It's even worse in media. If Facebook and Google grow their business, $22 billion this year. We now get the majority of our news from our social social media feeds and the majority of our news coming off of social media feeds is fake news. Um, <clears throat> these companies and CEOs wrap themselves in a new blue pink rainbow and blue blanket to create an illusionist trick. Um, I think that people should should um, take a part of this and start to be more authentic. Uh, 
stop the, the use of many social media that is controlling us because of the because of the problems we have in our social environment um, that we are like refugeeing refugee in a, in our in a fake world and this is something that is prejudicating us thank you